Alrighty guys, so today I'm at Cuba Tools. We are gonna go over some pricing when it comes to the Hilti Neuron tools. And we're gonna compare them to other brands if they did the same thing that Hilti did. And if, uh, just like the thumbnail, we are actually gonna use Ryobi as an example. So let's go to Home Depot. Let's go over some of these tool prices and let's see uh, let's see if what Ryobi would, I already did a video like this, but it wasn't really that in depth. Let's see what Ryobi would actually cost if we did the same thing that Hilti did. So I got my calculator, let's Ryobi. Hammer drill. Alrighty, so we are going to whip out this. So that's a hundred and because the point of doing this is because to, uh, most of these brands have sales and they have deals if you bought a kit. But with Hilti, uh, but with Hilti, which I'm hoping that Hilti changed this for their for a regular customer, for your average consumer, not some big huge corporation that buys like a hundred uh, hammer drills. There will be hammer drills, a hundred and nine hundred and nineteen dollars tool only. So let's calculate that. One one nine. Now we are we are not going to include taxes with this. All right. So let's do Ryobi battery. We'll do a four amp hour battery. Like I said, you know it's one hundred fifty dollars for two of them, but we're going to do one individual one if we could even find one. That's a six amp hour. $119 for a single four amp hour new battery. All right, so I saw the two amp hour up there, so $80. All right, then we need a charger. Uh, no, not that charger. We'll do so uh, $45 for the charger. All right, we're not going to include the bag, but we're not done yet. We need Ryobi Impact Driver. Tool only. All right, so $100 for the Impact Driver. Plus 100. All right, so for this for this tool kit that you see, if you bought this the same way you bought Hilti tools, this two tool combo kit with two batteries and a charger would be $463 and that is why that's in the thumbnail. All right, so, but because the most, a lot, like pretty much all these brands have deals with combo kits, pretty much the exact kit, including a bag and a smaller uh, and a different charger, $200. Instead of pay, buying this stuff for $463, you get this kit for $200. All right, so like Hilti really needs to start doing this stuff. All right, so let's go to the Hilti website. You know, like it's, a, it's, a, it's 2022, it's time to make a change. Hilti really needs to implement these tool sales to, uh, their, their, to their regular consumers that just get a couple of tools and a couple of batteries, you know, then get the, then get maintenance on it or, or whatnot. And, and not the individuals that buy a hundred hammer drills for the entire crew. All right. So for the, the new Neuron hammer drill, it is a hundred. Okay. Let's take these out. For the new Neuron Hammer Drill, it is $179. All right, so let's include one of those, one of those, and then we go down here, close and confirm. All right, so we have one bag, one charger, one battery, which that, that should actually be two batteries. So we're going to add one. Select. Confirm. Continue. Continue. We got our, now we got everything. Let's go to the final checkout. So this kit, the same kit that's pretty much from, uh, this is the wrong charger, by the way. 
it's the wrong charger but it's okay they pretty much cost the same so this kit cost six hundred and eighty two dollars now just like ryobi's kit would have cost four hundred and sixty three dollars which is ridiculous hilti needs to implement some sort of discount if they are if if there's an individual like you or me that just wants to get a couple of tools and a couple of batteries you know they need to implement some sort of discount if you make up a kit because as you can see these tools aren't that expensive when they're tool only and you buy them separately without anything like this impact wrench uh this impact driver is 169 dollars and the hammer drill is 180 dollars Let's see what Milwaukee's uh, that uh, their fuel impact driver and hammer drill kit is. All right, so with two batteries, with two five amp hour batteries, a hard case, a charger, and two tools, four hundred dollars. And so Ryobi's tools would be even more expensive than Milwaukee's. You know, assuming that Ryobi didn't do some sort of discount kit, and Milwaukee is. But so that's the point of this video. I hope Hilti implements some sort of system that will actually give their, the, a regular customer, your average customer, uh, a discount on these, on these tools. It's like, because these, if, for many of these brands, these tools are expensive. And I'll give you an example. The reason why I haven't even uh, bought into it yet because it's too rich for my blood. And that is the Makita 40 volt line. See, $209 for tool only, which that's more expensive than Hilti. I don't know why I did that. There we go. All right, but if you buy it as a kit, see this, uh, there are a 40 volt uh, hammer drill, that's 209. That's more expensive than the, the new Hilti Neuron stuff. Like these tools are getting expensive and Makita is in the same boat. They don't really give, on these new 40 volt stuff, they're not really giving you discounts. $400 for a single tool, two batteries, charger in a bag for their impact driver. $400 for their uh, seven and a quarter inch circular saw. Uh, a one battery charger in a bag. You know, six thirty nine for this kit. If Ryobi didn't do discounts like they like every other brand would, that Ryobi kit would still cost more than this uh, Makita forty volt two tool combo kit with two batteries, charger, and a bag. That's four fifty, and that's not including taxes. And that Ryobi isn't including taxes either. So like these tools are getting expensive. Hilti isn't the only one in the boat that is. Uh, that's not giving good discounts if you're making it into a kit. But like I said, $400 for this kit is insane. That's insane. And I don't even think, and they're two point, and they're to, uh, it's a 2.5 amp hour battery. And I think that might be a four amp hour battery there, but still. All right, so the real the, the final question for I have for you guys, leave it in the comments. Would you guys pay $463 for that Ryobi uh, two-tool combo kit that I have in the thumbnail? I don't think so. I wouldn't. I wouldn't. But yet, for Makita right here, the, there's $400 for a single tool. And the same thing with Hilti. It, it's expensive. Like, Makita really needs to wake up and change this. And I think Hilti needs to implement some sort of discount system because they, they've never done that before. I think that they should. So that's pretty much it, you guys. I hope you found this video helpful and, and entertaining. Please like this video. Please hit the bell button to be notified of future videos. And please subscribe to the channel. This is Dave Nicholas. Thank you for tuning in. I'll see you guys next time.